Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello, my name is Saifu Anwar, and my student number is 2121206. And now I'm going to bring a speech about the advantages and the disadvantages about vaccines. Have you ever heard about vaccines? As we know that we are living in the years of COVID-19 pandemic, you must be familiar with the word of vaccine. Now, the government is pushing us to get vaccinated. Some of us are so excited about it, and some of us are not. But did you realize that not all people know about what the vaccine is? What is it for? What are the benefits from the vaccine? And does it have a negative effect for our body if we got a vaccine? So, what are vaccines? Vaccine is a preparation that is used to stimulate the body's immune response against diseases. Rather than threatening diseases after the course, vaccination prevents us from getting sick in the first place. Without vaccines, we risk serious illness and damage from diseases such as pneumonia, tetanus, and polio. Our world's recent encounter with coronavirus has shown us the importance of vaccination. Coronavirus related deaths have significantly decreased in the third wave compared with the first wave. These improvements were made possible by vaccination campaign conducted worldwide. Vaccine preventable diseases have not disappeared. Viruses and bacteria that cause illness are still present and can be passed on to those who are not protected by vaccine. Although many diseases are not common in a particular country, global travel facilitates the spread of diseases. Number two, major medical organizations such as WHO confirms that vaccines are some of the safest medical devices available. Number three, vaccine protect the herd. Vaccine not only protect individuals, but they also stop the spread of disease among the people around you and offer their protection to society as a whole. And here are the disadvantages of vaccine. Number one, vaccines contain harmful ingredients. Different vaccines have different compositions, which in some cases can be dangerous. Number two, even though vaccines help us a lot in fighting deadly diseases, it does not provide a 100% guarantee. Number three, vaccines are not natural, and natural immunity is stronger than vaccines. So the conclusion is, an effective way to prevent diseases before they affect you is to get vaccinated. It's easy, safe, and convenient. Vaccines train your immune system by working with your body's natural defenses to build protection against microbes, such as viruses or bacteria, by producing antibodies that are naturally produced by the immune system to fight diseases. Our immune system is designed to remember. After being exposed to one or more doses of the vaccine, we usually remain protected from the diseases for years, decades, or even a lifetime. Therefore, vaccines are extremely effective, even though it doesn't provide a hundred percent guarantee. So that's all from me. I'm so sorry for all my mistakes. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.